In pathology, we have always been instrumental in identifying and diagnosing disease, and we always will be. But what's exciting about our profession is that it's changing. Our role is expanding beyond diagnosis as biomarker discovery continues to advance. And now, more than ever, our job is fundamental in helping our colleagues make more informed treatment decisions. The role of a pathologist is different from that of most other healthcare providers. We rarely get to meet patients that we help diagnose. However, the role of pathology is changing as we become more involved and more central in a patient's cancer journey and in their lives. Patients like Sandy. My name is Sandy. I'm a mother of four, grandmother of seven, and great-grandmother of five. My family means everything to me. The summer of 2015, I called my doctor and went in for a checkup and found a huge mass. After I was diagnosed with non-small cell lung cancer, stage four, I started doing a lot of research. I wasn't going to let it get in the way of my life. I Googled everything related to the treatment of lung cancer, and that's when I learned about biomarkers. The pathology community knows the goal of biomarker testing is to identify a more personalized approach to treatment by identifying patients who are likely to respond to specific therapies. We play a central role in this testing as gatekeepers of the tissue, which means that we think strategically about how a patient's tissue is used, not just for the initial diagnosis, but also for future testing that may be necessary. Initially, I was tested for ALK and the EGFR gene. They both came back negative. On my initial therapy, the cancer had spread. My doctor told me that I might have to have another biopsy to check for another biomarker. That concept did not thrill me to death because the biopsy is not comfortable, and that meant another wait. But we found out that the pathologist took enough tissue, saved enough tissue, to do the next test for the PDL1. I was thrilled when they didn't need to do another biopsy. And I knew my doctor would come up with a plan and we'd get on with it. Obtaining a repeat biopsy can be challenging or even impossible for some patients and has a big impact on the timing. In oncology, every minute counts and delays in obtaining biopsies with sufficient material can be challenging and have a large impact on treatment decisions. In this critical moment during her battle with cancer, Sandy was fortunate that her pathologist had preserved sufficient tissue for additional biomarker testing. Biomarker testing was important to me because it helped the doctor determine the best treatment possible for my disease. You know, it, it takes a whole village to raise a child, and it takes a whole village to go with a cancer patient through the treatment options. Everybody that's on my team is working for me, and I get very emotional when I think about it, uh, but they're all out there. It takes a lot of people to walk you from the initial diagnosis to the end result, but it starts with the pathologist. Thank you so much for doing what you do. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart because that was the start of my journey. And ultimately, that's what made a difference in my life.